so when we get to basic metallurgy, um, so what are some things that people you could share with, um, let's say business owners or people coming up through, or, you know, people, people that think it's not important to know, um, what are some basic sure. things about metallurgy that, uh, that you would share with them? That oh, Greg, this is my this is my favorite topic. I have a, I have a whole uh, you know we we spoke uh, about this the other day. Uh, you know I do consulting, direct consulting, but with a uh, an education side because because uh, you know I'm passionate about the field and the subject. Yeah, what's, um, what's the business name, man? Shout out for yourself. Yeah, yeah, uh, Mendoza Metallurgy. Uh, yeah. MendozaMetallurgy.com. Um, I uh, you know I came out of the pandemic like a lot of people looking at things differently than than I had and. I wanted to, um, you know, provide metallurgy assistance to people who may not have had it. You know, I, I've only worked at big companies. I've only seen metallurgists working for big companies. And I thought that everyone could benefit from access to, to metallurgy. Yeah. Um, and uh, not only, am, you know, would I want to do the work, but I also want to teach people so that they, they understand as well. So every class that I have is uh, a direct result of um, some interaction or uh, need that I see in industry. So the one you and I are talking about um, is my metallurgy executive summary, and we're gonna we're gonna do a, do a snippet of that. Sure. Um, it is a is a class that I made for every every person that I that I ran into in business who didn't understand what I was doing or why I was in that meeting, um, whether it's uh, you know, someone who works in the in quality or uh, on the supply side, in management, a supervisor, um, you know, just people who who didn't really understand what metallurgy was and how it interacted with with the business itself. 